Hi everyone and welcome to the Wildlife Family. This is our first review video. Now, a little bit about what we're going to do with the reviews. So hopefully it's the first of many, but our plan is to review products. So since the page has kicked off massively um, and Matt and Dad um, doing their YouTube videos, we've got quite a few uh, followers now. I think I believe there's over 5,000 on our friends page and there's uh, additional followers on that and plus we got our YouTube channel that we have quite a few um, views on. So with that obviously we've been talking to manufacturers and guys with products that they want to promote. So we decided that we would look into this but we wanted to do reviews on products without any obligations. So what I mean by that is we didn't want any uh, sponsorship at the moment um, so what we wanted to do is to get products if we could get them review them ourselves honestly what we found good with them what we didn't and then obviously be able to have our own poetic license in that we could describe them exactly how we found them and not be any under any obligation it's not to say that any of the products that we review we won't become ambassadors on or sponsors on us but at the moment, uh, the products that we're going to be reviewing, we don't have uh, any ties to. So, Empire Cartridges, these guys here, have been brave enough to send Dad and I some sample cartridges. We're going out tomorrow, Sunday the 16th, hopefully on a decent uh, Pigeon and Crow Day. And with that, we're going to be trialing these along with um, our usual cartridges, but we're going to give these a go. Now, Empire themselves, they're a little bit like us, the wildlife family. So they, they've always been into shooting, um, I believe mainly clays, a bit of the game. And they decided, you know what, we want to make cartridges and we want to make ones that we want to be proud of. So ones that, you know, you promote the... That go to you know that cartridge that when it's been a bad day you you root for your cartridge bag for and you think do you know what I, I really need to use because I trust this one so that's what they wanted to make um, I believe from talking to them that they just decided to go through everything that they knew that worked everything they that they thought they could improve on and then make a cartridge themselves and that's what they did. So they have a small range at the moment, so only in 12 bore, only in lead, uh, 28 gram, 32s, 30s, um, I believe there's some 27s there, have a look, check out their website, they're in talks at the moment for other products and other bore ranges I believe, um, so they're up and coming. So the cartridge themselves, should we have a little look? Here they are. Oh, you can see that so they're red but clear so you can see through them a nice red cartridge it's well handy because dad's auto kicks them 60 miles away the last thing you need on a on a field is a, a natural color that uh, beds in so nice to have a red shell nice to have one that you can see from miles off as you can see nice empire logo on there themselves so I'll take some pictures some better pictures and put them up at the end but today just wanted to show you before we go out tomorrow a little bit about them a little bit about the company and hopefully after this there will be some decent footage and you can see for yourselves and then at the end we'll do a little review me and dad dad's using his Beretta Auto I'm using my brand new Beretta that's on the Facebook page hope you guys have been checking it out and we'll have a little look at it and give our honest opinions at the end. All the pros, all the cons. If you have any questions about the cartridges, give us a shout. We're more than willing to help if we know the answers. We probably don't, but we'll try. And I'll see you in a minute.
So we're just finishing up now here at Wildlife Family. There's Matt just hiding on a hike. So I think combined bag over 200, yeah. and something. Yeah. Um, crows and pigeons. So we're finishing up a little bit earlier than, than usual, but we're all too hot and bothered. But so we're calling it a day. Yeah, so. and plus, yeah, Dad's got a mosey on back down the way. So, Empire cartridges. What do you think? Yeah. Today we've been shooting Empire. Um, we had some seven and a half, some sixes and some fives. Um, the seven and a half, great for anything decoying. Um, the sixes and fives, yeah, 40, 45, 50 yards, no problem at all. The fives, very impressed with them. Um, hard hitting, um, killed some extremely good birds. Um, they definitely hit well, didn't they, them fives? The fives, yeah. Impact was, was yeah, very, very good. Um, fired from the auto, no issues at all with, with um, ejecting or jamming or anything. Run extremely well. Um, yeah, very impressed with the with the fives especially. Um, but like I say, sixes and sevens ideal for, for anything decoying. But if you want that extra little bit of a punch, I'd definitely go for the fives. So yeah, I should give them a try on the crows next time and see how we get on with them yeah i think that's the only con i think the sixes and fives were definitely something we was both grabbing for over the yeah. over the seven and a halves because we did find that one once i was decoying it wasn't too bad but at the beginning you needed them sixes and fives to just to give you that a little bit more didn't you? give it a little bit the, the thing i like about them is it, i know it's psychological but if you can see the shot you can't say there's nothing in them so I like to see the lighter colour in so that you can actually see the shot in the end of the shell. Crimping very good, no deformities whatsoever. And you can't miss um, them when they're out in the field. So. No, <laughs> and they're fibre as well, which uh, is a help. So again, a good shell, a UK company, I think they're one to watch out for. Yeah, I, I really so. do. Let's I see how they get on, so. on the crows when we're doing Yeah, I think, it, I think I'll do some pattern testing um, just to see what they're like through some different chokes. But at the moment, to a moderated choke, they shot very well. Like I say, the fives, very impressive.